How do I tell if my sockets or tombstones are shunted or non-shunted? This is an important question to answer for linear fluorescent or LED fixtures because it will ensure that you get the maximum life out of your lighting and avoid dangerous fire hazards. Before we start, we need to gather a few materials. First, we need the sockets in question. Second, we need a multimeter. And finally, we need protection. Mm, maybe not that kind of protection. Oh, there it is. All right, let's get started. You may be able to tell what kind of sockets you have with a simple visual inspection. The bottom of this socket only has one set of electrical contacts, or points of entry for the wires. This means the electrical contacts inside the sockets are connected. This is probably a shunted socket. For comparison, the bottom of this socket has two sets of electrical contacts, or entry points for the wires, which means the electrical contacts inside the socket are not connected. This is probably a non-shunted socket. Looking at the electrical contacts may give you an indication, but the only way to be certain about the type of socket that you have is to test it with a multimeter. Before we get started, let's make sure the electricity is disconnected from your light fixture and sockets. Next, make sure that the multimeter is set to continuity, which essentially tells you if the circuit you're testing makes a connected loop. You can test this by touching the multimeter probes together, and the display will change. Here's the shunted sockets again. Touch the multimeter probes to the contacts where the two pins go. The display changes, indicating that the circuit makes a loop. These contacts are joined, confirming that the socket is shunted. Some multimeters will also beep or light up when the continuity is detected. Now, let's test the non-shunted sockets again. Touch the multimeter probes to the contacts where the pins go. The display does not change, indicating that the circuit is broken or separated. These contacts are not joined, confirming that the socket is non-shunted. If you are wondering which kind of sockets you need for your specific fixture, watch our next video that gives an overview of the possible socket combinations for fluorescent and LED tubes.